In this video, I am going to start with an example of line inclined with both the planes. Okay, so for this, a question is written. Okay, so the question is the top view of a 75 mm long line AB measure 65. Okay, means original length is 75. Okay original length is 75 and its top view top view is measured as 65 okay top view of a 75 mm long line a b measure 65 okay while the length of its front view is 50 mm okay so this is front view okay length of front view is 50 mm its one and a is in the hp okay one end is in the HP and 12 mm in front of the BP. Okay, 12 mm in front of the BP means it will be shown below XY. Okay, XY is the reference uh, reference line. Okay, so draw the projection of AB and determine its inclination with HP and BP. Okay, so in this case, the uh, the line the line is actually uh, it was inclined with both the planes. Okay. So first of all, I am going to assume that uh, the line is parallel to one plane. Okay. So the line AB, I am going to assume that it is parallel to vertical plane. Okay. So if line AB is parallel to vertical plane. Okay. So this is the uh, this is the vertical plane. Okay. So if it is parallel to vertical plane, means this is like this. Okay. So parallel to vertical plane and, and then it must be inclined with horizontal plane. So if this is horizontal plane and this is the vertical plane, so your line will be like this. Okay. So in that case, in that case, it is written in the question that the top view of 75 mm long line AB measure 65. Okay. So top view means from top if you see, so the shadow you see the shadow which is you are going to see this so the shadow is 65 okay and if you see from this side <coughs> then you are going to see the original length okay so original length will be above xy reference plane okay so this is 75 now i'm going to start okay so that you can understand so this is xy the reference line okay and it is given in the question that uh, it's one and a is in the hp okay one and a is in the hp so one point a is in the xy plane in that case okay and 12 mm in front of the bp means uh, it will be 12 mm below xy okay so i have to draw okay one line from here to here so this is 12 mm okay so in that case this is my A and this will be my A dash. Okay, so first work is to mark A dash and A point. Okay. Next, you have to draw the line which is 65 mm long. Okay, because I am going to assume that the line is parallel to BP okay so if this is parallel to BP then you are going to see the front uh, top view okay top view is parallel to XY so this is 65 okay so so this is the 65 mm long line okay so this is nothing but a B Now project this line, okay, project this line in the upward direction, okay, so this is the projector, okay, okay, so after projecting this line, okay, in the upward directions, now taking center as a dash, okay, and radius equal to 75 okay radius equal to 75 because it is written that the length is 75 okay so 
सेवेंटी फाइव टेकिंग सेवेंटी फाइव एज ए रेडियस यू हेफ टू ड्रॉ ए आर्क ओके यू हेफ टू ड्रॉ ए आर्क सो दिस आर्क इज गोइंग टू इंटरसेप्ट द लाइन व्हिच इज एट बी डे पॉइंट आई कैन से ओके सो दिस पॉइंट इज नथिंग बट द बी डे ओके नाउ I am going to draw the locus. Okay, so this is nothing but the locus. Okay, so this is C D. So C D is nothing but the locus. Now I am going to join this line. Okay, from A dash to B dash. Okay, so you can see there. This is seventy-five. Okay, now I'm going to draw this. Okay, so this is by assuming uh, your line AB parallel to BP. Okay, now I'm going to assume that the line is parallel to HP. So in, now I'm going to draw. Uh, acha uh, suppose i am going to assume that the line is parallel to hp okay so if it is parallel to hp so it must be some inclination with the bp okay so now this case is now this one okay it is parallel to parallel to hp and with some inclination with the bp okay so in that case it is given that the front view of uh, Front view is 50 mm. Okay, 50 mm. It is given front view. Okay, so this is the line. Okay, now it is parallel to uh, HP. So front view it is given 50 mm. So if you see from this side, okay, so this will be front view. Okay, so if the line having some inclination with the BP, then obviously uh, the front view dimensions is less than the original length. Original length is 75. Okay, now front view is 78. So from this. i am going to see the front view okay so as the point a is in the xy so my front view will be from here to here okay a dash to some point b1 dash okay and its distance is uh, dimension is 50 mm so i am going to draw this okay so from here to here this is 50 mm so this is b1 dash Now I am going to project the line to the downward directions. Okay, previously it was in upward directions. Now it is in this case it will be in downward direction. Okay. So I have told that in this case uh, the line is assuming in this way. Okay. So in this case front view will be fifty mm, and if you see from top. So top view will be is your original length. So top view is seventy five. So top view is generally placed in the bottom of the x y. So if you draw a line from uh, here, okay, here, then this line will be how much seventy five mm. Now I am going to draw a line taking radius, okay, radius as a and uh, sorry, red, uh, center as a and radius seventy five. I am going to draw an arc over here. Okay, so I have drawn this R. So this is nothing but your B one. Okay, this is your B one. Now I am going to draw uh, the line. So this is nothing but the seventy five from here to here. Okay, and this will be the locus. Okay. So this will be the locus. Okay, so this locus is suppose E F. E F is the locus. So these are the inclination. Okay, which is asked in the question. You see that determine its inclination with H P and B P. Okay, so these are the inclination. Okay, so this is inclination with H P. So this is theta, and this is with B P, which is phi. Okay. so theta is the inclination of line ab 
uh, with HP and phi is the inclination of line AB with BP. Okay. Now I am going to draw the projections. Okay. So taking A as a center, AB as a radius. Okay. I am going to draw an arc. Okay, I'm going to draw a arc. Now taking A dash as a center, A B one dash, A B one dash as a uh, radius. I'm going to draw a arc. So from here to here, I'm going to draw a arc. Okay. So these are the point. This is B two dash, B two dash, and this is B two. Okay. Now I am going to join these lines. Okay. So you can see that this is 65. Okay. This is 65. So this is nothing but uh, the top view. It is written. Okay. 65 is the top view. So here this is 65. And here this one is 50. Okay. You can see. So this one is 50. So from here to here you can draw this. So this is your 50 mm. So it is written that 50 mm is the front view. Okay. So this is the projection. Okay. Now you can draw a line from here to here. So this is nothing but the confirmation. Okay. Confirmation. So if this point and this point will be in straight line. Then your uh, drawing of projection is true. Okay. Now you can uh, write the dimension. So this is 65. Okay. This is 75. So you use the dimension line to draw this. Okay. And this is your 50. Okay. And this is again 75. Okay. So this is 75. Okay, so this is about the uh, inclination, okay, straight line inclined with both the planes, okay, thank you.